first, turn yourself in. That's the message from Police Chief Frank Straub tonight to one of two suspects accused of beating a World War II veteran to death. The first suspect, 16-year-old Demetrius Glenn, turned himself into police just before midnight. Police are now searching for that 16-year-old. Keenan Adams Kennard, KXY 4's Andy Bishop is live in the studio. And Andy, the chief says it's only a matter of time before Adams Kennard is arrested. And the chief is very confident that this kid will soon be in jail. Both suspects have juvie records, including convictions of assault. Now they will be charged as adults for murder and robbery. He didn't deserve this. A true American hero now making international headlines because of the horrific way in which he died. It's so senseless and unnecessary, not for 50 bucks. In court documents released today, detectives described the brutal scene they responded to Wednesday night in the parking lot of the Fraternal Order of the Eagles in North Spokane. Detectives found 88-year-old Delbert Shorty Belton, a World War II vet, bleeding profusely from his head and face, lying in the back of his car. Police believe two teens robbed Belton, beat him, and ran away. We're not going to tolerate that type of behavior from 16-year-olds or anyone else in this community. The suspects, however, were caught on camera at several nearby stores. Hours after those photos were published, 16-year-old Demetrius Glenn turned himself in. It certainly demonstrates um, that we as a community and we as a nation uh, need to be much more attentive uh, to our young people, uh, to have two um, juveniles commit such a uh, vicious attack, um, to assault somebody who was just minding their own business, suggests that we have some deeper issues that we need to confront as a community and as a society. Police Chief Frank Straub says he's not concerned about a motive right now. Nothing justifies what happened to Belton, a true American hero, a man who survived a gunshot wound in Okinawa, only to die in a parking lot waiting for a friend. What is this world coming to anyway? They're raising a bunch of idiots. I mean, how somebody. would they like somebody do that to them? when they get 88 years old. And the chief says there is no indication this attack was racially motivated. The Spokane Public School District tells us that Demetrius Glenn was a student at Bancroft, but left in February. Keenan Adams Kennard was going to be a junior at Lewis and Clark this fall. Reporting live tonight, Annie Bishop, KXLY4.